Eric Franklin is an artist with wood. This is the first house he ever built, his own, located on Sixes River in Curry County. The house is the result of an unexpected inheritance, allowing Eric and Pat Franklin to invest $25,000 in materials and two years of hard work. The design results are striking, both from a distance and close up. We had been living in uh, small houses in the area that we were renting that had low ceilings and, and uh, small windows. And we were reacting to that, I guess, all at the same time. Uh, uh, we wanted to have a lot of light in the winter mm -hmm. and be able to use that light at different times of the day for the different areas of the house we'd be living in. The house is small but gives a sense of spaciousness through open beam construction and a lack of walls. Each room simply flows into the next. The construction process was not so fluid though. The couple report numerous clashes over design as the house took shape. But the results, as seen in the kitchen, are a creative combination of art and function. With time, the memories of conflict fade and the excitement lingers. As the structure evolved, it, it was really a thrill. We'd come in and, and sit around on the beams at night and, and look at the stars just because mm -hmm. it, was, it was something new. Yeah, it was <laughs> like uh, we're living in a growing, growing sculpture almost. The sculpture is finished now to be experienced every day, to be lived in and the Franklins like it that way. Uh, I've always liked boats and woodwork and, uh, and fine furniture, and I wanted the house to be a, a, a live-in cabinet, something that you, you tuck yourself into a drawer and slide into it and just really enjoy it. And that's what it's become. This is Bill Bradbury reporting from Sixes River in Curry County, Oregon.